Now at 11, one Miami-Dade police officer doing okay tonight after a day on the job that he'll probably remember forever. A suspect went on the attack and bit him. CBS 4's Hank Tester live at the jail in West Miami-Dade where that suspect is tonight. Hank. Now, watch the video we're going to show you. They dragged this guy out of the courthouse, and he has a net mask over his face. That's to prevent him from spitting and biting any other officers. Let's take a look. This guy is getting the heavy escort out of the Miami-Dade Metropolitan Justice Center. He's not happy, nor are the cops that have him cuffed and headed down the courthouse steps. Huh? Huh? So it started inside this courtroom. This man had thought he just had to appear, nothing more. The judge said he was going to jail for missing a court date. And there was a man that had bit an officer, and he took out a chunk of meat off his right or left hand, and he was bleeding. Here's the guy the police said did the biting, 29-year-old Godel Lavelle. He's had numerous brushes with the law, mostly disorderly conduct, battery, and trespassing. Shown here with a net bag over his head to contain spit and bites. That's the officer involved, Officer Anthony Pando, standing beside the fire rescue unit. You can see the bandage just above his wrist. Pando looks like he's okay, but sent to Jackson Memorial Hospital to be checked out. According to the witness, he was mad, bro. I can tell you that one. He didn't look like he was in pain. I know he was in pain, but he was mad. The attacker likely faces battery on a police officer charges. Next time he comes to court, he'll be in a red suit and cuffs. Well, like we said, big trouble for this guy. As we said, battery on a law enforcement officer, also resisting an officer with violence and disorderly conduct. Subject has a history of this. Reporting, I'm Hank Tester, CBS4 News Tonight.